Are you hungry? Why are we late for your baba? I'm sorry. Come here. Get a good look at his at your feet, are you, big boy? You say happy Thanksgiving? I know I'm a day late, huh? Because Grandpa already put the video up, didn't he? Well, the moon's out. <laughs> it's about almost nine o'clock at night, I guess it is now. So there is licorice, the black and white one right there. She's going to butcher. There is our little heifer from this year, um, but I had one that I got in because she looks really, really close to calving, right? So, Maureen went up to check water and, you know, check to make sure everything was okay before we crawled into bed for the night until midnight when he was going to go check again. We heard some mooing from our, our bedroom, and Charlie decided, which is Licorice's mom, Decided to give us a beautiful black and white heifer <laughs> on Thanksgiving. So now we're trying to think of um, Thanksgiving names. So if any of you guys in the comments have any suggestions, I would love that. Um, so yes, happy late Thanksgiving, guys. I have my little present. Thank you, Adam. So one way or another, I guess they were going to give me... A calf for Thanksgiving, whether it be the one in the barn or this one. And I tell you what, I separated my ones for tomorrow, the bull and the two calves that need to be banded. And the cow that obviously she could drop at any minute. And I we're supposed to be freezing. We're supposed to be like 28 degrees in the morning. So, you know, I wanted to make sure they were safe and comfy in the barn. Yeah, well, she had no sign. Okay, no sign at all. No sign. Okay, no sign at all. Literally, no sign. I more just went up there a half hour to go to check everything. And there was nothing. <laughs> so now he was grabbing the tractor because, unfortunately, it's a long trek up there to the barn. But luckily, this cow is seasoned and she's been through it a couple times and kept her girls. And that so happens to be one of her girls. So, I guess that's Licorice's replacement because I guess <laughs> Maury's brother Adam knew that we needed another little black and white one and she is gorgeous and everyone knows I'm not a Angus lover per se um Charlie is my half pin scour half Angus cross and I love her to death um licorice is my quarter pin scour quarter Angus and half Hereford and she looks the spinning image of her mama um so I'm I'm excited to see what this little girl does it's like magic, we're in the barn. <laughs> so, I got a limo that is pregnant. She might be pregnant, I'm not so sure if she's that far along. You're open, bitch. Cause it's her baby. She's smelling her full sister all over me right now. <laughs> she's pregnant. <laughs> and my poor baby Stripes is pregnant. I only got one little heifer over there. So I have a total of, she'll be first time mom. She'll, my, she'll be my only first timer. She was my other one, but we don't count her because she's going to butcher or freezer camp, I should say. Um, so next year I'll have first timer for sure back there behind everyone. Lainey. And then that's a male. <laughs> she's a pregnant one we got in earlier. He's getting banded tomorrow. My poor boy, Barney. My poor boy, huh? And then little Mr. Spark. He was born right after uh, 4th of July. So he's getting banded as well. <sighs> Better lighting over here. There's Mama Charlie. And our little surprise girl. Maury went down to get um, some vitamin A and D and B. So I want to get that into her. We are already cold. We had a really cold tractor ride. Like I am. I, yeah. It, and I just took a shower from 
getting those guys in after Thanksgiving dinner because I took a shower beforehand. But look at we get more Laney girl. Yeah, we get more of our Laney girl. So dad I'm assuming will probably post all of my stuff because it'll be close to five minutes by the time everything's all said and done, huh? Yeah. But the good news is that little Missy is right on time. Unlike Laney. Laney was two weeks early. So everyone's doing good. It just makes a long night for me. Um, so we'll see if my very pregnant baby bat woman back here. We'll see when you have your baby, huh? Yeah, I know it. Everyone's in here. <laughs> yeah, we get more of our Laney girl. So dad, I'm assuming will probably post all of my stuff because it'll be close to five minutes by the time everything's all said and done, huh? Yeah, but the good news is that little Missy is right on time. Unlike Laney, Laney was two weeks early. So everyone's doing good. It just makes a long night for me. Um, so we'll see if my very pregnant baby bat woman back here. We'll see when you have your baby, huh? Yeah, I know it. Everyone's in here. <laughs> Literally, they have over half the barn. Well, yeah, they have over half the barn over here. Um, but I only have four head out. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's where we're at. I'm waiting around just making sure uh calf was already up once i got her up right before we took the tractor ride so hopefully i can bring you guys back for more of her hopefully up and eating i missed your little jumpy come on lady come here oh you turkey come here really come here don't wag your tail at me and look at me come here laney girl come here Come on! <laughs> there was a little jump. Yeah, there was a little jump. <laughs> you goofball, I missed it. She ran over there, and then run next to the door, and then run back, and then she obviously finally went around. But unfortunately, we're gonna have to put Mama and our new baby right here <laughs> which means Lainey is going to get the back part so that's easy we're just going to stack a couple bales around the back of the big bale over there and right across here that way she has a little spot to chillax um but the problem is i got too many in here for her to focus on her baby you are the cutest little surprise focus. that's a little red and brown mark <laughs> So she's got them swirled in. You are just the cutest little girl. There's a better picture of it. She's got a red brow mark. Hi. So pretty. So pretty. I really want to get you eaten. All right, the neighbor girls, our neighbor twins named her Cranberry, just because it starts with a C. And she's, and it's Thanksgiving, so she's trying to nurse right now. And we are on a teat. I'm an idiot. I just realized her little face markings look like she's from the band Kiss. We might be changing her name. <laughs> which doesn't start with a C, which is what I like to do with Charlie. But you look like you're from the band Kiss. You do. You look like a little band member. Good morning, Charlie. Well, good morning, baby. 
You got a nice full tummy this morning. That's a big stretch. And you lost your afterbirth, so that's a good thing. You're looking more red than black there, baby. Good morning, pretty girl. Good morning, Laney. Yeah. 